different environment too. Oh, those will be interesting. This doesn't seem like a place you find good men. We're not looking for good men. We're looking for mercenaries. We have no hope of taking the fortress without them. If we make it far enough to hire them with those things out there. Sandworms? You got nothing to fear. These bones! This place has swallowed things larger than us! <laughs> oh, like that? Kill us all. That worm has excellent Get timing. It's all sand. Now you got a point there. Keep calm! Keep moving! Where? Oh, we still get a speed boost. Don't have a ring that's a ring of power, but I can still get the speed boost. Oh, was that end game? Okay. <laughs> I thought I messed it up for a second. Like sometimes they do that. That's seen by my camera. <laughs> Short one's okay, but is that a orc or is it a dwarf? It's a dwarf. Ah, I was hoping that wasn't a corpse I was dragging home. A bit, a bit weird, now, eh? <laughs> I think he's from no, the no. first game. What happened in a DLC? Uh, I'm sorry, lad. They weren't as lucky as you. Thank you for saving me. Oh, you don't thank me. Uh, thank this. <clears throat> that little darling's a bit twitchy, but she should get you up to my camp, no trouble. I've uh, got a newer one myself. The grappling hook? Out all the hitches. Nice. Hitches. What of advice about the claim? If you don't like ice, don't look down. And if you don't like dwarf asses, don't look up. I think it is him, because in Shadow of Mordor, there's a DLC, like a Beast Hunter DLC, and I, he was like a dwarf hunting in Mordor. This device! You built it? You don't need to flatter me, lad. I already snatched you from the nasties. No, what you got there is Numenorian. Loads of their contrivances scattered around from way back. Very useful. Trick is grabbing it without the worms grabbing you. I found a few promising sites. Got them all sketched out. That's pretty cool. You bring what you find back to me. I'll tinker till it does what it used to. Or does so Oops. Forgetting to put the camera in. Anyway, then you can field test it. Make sure it's safe. Sound good? More than fair. Oh, yeah, it's a different take on the uh, movement. And it gives you kind of powers, but more mechanically based. I can still climb short things, yep. If I remember in Shadow of Mordor, he actually came here with his dwarf brother, but he got killed hunting things, and then you end up he ends up helping Talion in the first game. Not the most convenient spot if you're moving in furniture. But on the plus side, worms don't like heights. Okay. Already excited for this DLC, looks pretty neat. So, what are you doing so far from Gondor? Looking for the vanishing suns. They're a mercenary company. Yes, I hired a few of them to look for Numenorian bits. Now I owe their leader a few <clears throat> mercenaries. I've got just the thing to get you to where they are. Just don't tell them where I am. What do I do? Just run off the edge of the cliff. Run off the edge of the cliff? And here, these are the places to poke around for more Numenorian goodies. Go on then. I've used this thing myself. Not a bump or a scratch. 
Press spacebar to open the kite while in the air. Interesting. Press E while gliding to drop. Light or vents on the ground to get boosted higher. See, laddie! Nothing to it! Now, whatever you do, don't! Ah, oh, you'll figure it out! <laughs> figure what out? I'm always thirsty. Is that not Hi. Right. Getting the hang of it. <sighs> This will go this way. All right, this, this is. Whoa! Definitely had some cool Just new ideas for this DLC. I like it so it far. Is all. Oh, that was a bonus objective too. Get there without touching the ground. Hey guys. <gasps> Are they hair drum? Uh, maybe. I don't think so, though. <laughs> Look kind of Spartanish. So many cutscenes. I just I don't want my camera blocking them. <laughs> I know it's not fun me pausing it every time. My name is Berenor. I am second captain of the Gondorian Guard at Minas Ethel. Minas Ethel has fallen some time ago, I remain. I am seeking soldiers. Well, it's difficult to be a captain without them. Lucky for you, I've got the finest warriors in all of Middle Earth. <laughs> Do you carry coin of any kind? Some. Some. You're going to need a lot more than some. <laughs> What are your plans for the raid? I assume you're not planning to retake Minas Ethel. I'm planning to take Shindrum. The fortress? No, 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 no. <laughs> that sounds like the work for heroes. All I can offer you are mercenaries. Look, why don't you come back when you have some more money? Or sense? What art? How do you know that name? You haven't changed! I remember a boy of seven, small for his age, so he had a lot to prove. And one day he decided that he was going to explore the caves of Umbar, but he got himself into a little bit of trouble. Lucky for him, he had a brother, a beautiful, courageous older brother who was sent to look for him. I was going to say, they look kind of alike. The reached him, he was moments away from being devoured by Karagors. <laughs> Karagors? Jagai? No, 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 little brother. <laughs> I, I am Serka now. Like you say, I'm like they look Serka, a little bit like the unkillable Serka, the insufferable Serka, the survivor. But I still bear some scars from my former life. How did you come to be here, among these Easterlings? Same old story. A village is raided, homes are looted, mothers and fathers are slaughtered, screaming tears. Orcs. Mercenaries. How is it? I should be thankful, though, of course, eh? Not every boy gets the chance to be raised among such a merry band of killers and thieves! <laughs> but you lead them. Yeah, only until I get a knife in my back. And believe me, that is how all leaders end up. But enough history. Blood only goes so far. You and I, we have business to transact. Water always tastes sweeter to it. So I guess instead of jewels you get that money. Oh, we got a healing elixirs now. I guess I should read that. When your health is low, hold left uh control button to open the weapon wheel, hold E to use a healing elixir. You can find more healing elixirs by killing orcs. So we got a gonna have a limited health supply. Baranor is immortal and carries no ring of power. If he dies, the story is over. Your progress on story missions and Torvin skill upgrades will carry forward, but your outposts and hired mercenaries will be lost. Interesting. 
Numenorean artifacts are scattered around the deserts of Lithlad. Recover these ancient devices and return them to Torvin to gain access to powerful Torvin skill upgrades. View a Torvin skill upgrades description in the character menu to see Torvin's sketch of the area to search. Find the Numenorean artifact there, then return it to Torvin to unlock the skill upgrade. Interesting. They went in a different direction with this. Very interesting. But it makes sense, Lorwise. I'm going to take that fortress. I better start with something smaller. Let's see about those outposts. That also means I should be much more careful about who I fight and why. Interesting. I guess as I get stronger, I get these bonuses to minions. I already forgot how you find the Numenorean stuff. <laughs> what did he say? Alright. I wonder how easy it's going to be to capture outposts, though. Because... Let's go ahead and do the next mission. Just kind of get a bit of a warm up. Zerko wants me to meet with him. I should find out what he wants. Here's that skull, unless there's more than one. Oh, you do still have focus, okay. The Numenorean set their minds to making a man fly. But when they figured out a device that could do it, they decided they weren't impressed enough with themselves. So they set about improving on it. How could a people who soar like birds fall so far that there's hardly any trace of them left? I wonder if there's one by each I can't each wait to see thing. what the dwarf does with this. Or maybe I can. Hmm. Oh. So I don't have arrows. I got this thing. That's interesting. Huh. That looks like there might be some in there. With the limited health stuff, I'm kind of hesitant to uh, fight people. Huh. Have you ever noticed how quickly the sun dries after you piss on it? Have you ever noticed how annoying you are? Let's see how quickly God dries. Oh, is that that one gate? Or maybe not. I'm trying to remember the pictures in my mind. Alright, let's do this mission first, though. Actually, what am I thinking? Let's go get this thing figured out. Gonna need some more firewood soon. One of these nights, those mercenaries are gonna catch me chopping down their trees. Oh! Alright, give it over! Search. Also, oh, this is where you... Okay. This is the basic one. So do I choose one? Oh no, this is the one I got. Press spacebar during a grapple to launch yourself past your target point. Your kite will open automatically if needed. Interesting. Hold it, enter range mode, shift to fire, press control to cycle amortize between steel bolts and concussion bombs. So I guess it does shoot stuff out. Interesting. Why would you press left shift to fire though? Why not like the mouse button, like everything else? Ah, oh, okay. Interesting. 
Let's see, we got execution, surge, making sure what we got here. Oh, perfect counters. Oh, wait. Oh, it only knocks them down. That's lame. They attack a chance of causing critical hits. Shoot fire pits to detonate. You can pin. Quick ground finishers. Automatically loot. No, okay. So we don't have too much. Now you'll have some fun, lad. All right. Oh, there's that tower. Wasn't that something? Stormed up to the keep and kicked down the... Gotta find this stuff. Let's see. Character. Yeah. We'll look for a battle thing like that. That's the keep in the distance, so there's a thing near that. There's the keep. Is that outside the walls or inside it? If I'm looking at that right, it's to the right of the spire. We did six more, and her name was Nalanax Harlar. Oh. And as the fortresses of Greater Mordor, except we will make this one our own. All right, here's this. Let's see. See, that's the front left. See, I can't tell if it's supposed to be up somewhere or it's showing it in the fortress, you know? Like before it showed the skull, it was actually in the skull, so it's probably in the fortress then. Interesting. Oh, it is there. Okay. <laughs> Get as many of these as we can early on. Countering enemies is great. What's even better is stopping them dead. And I do mean dead. The new Minorians knew that by using your opponent's momentum against him, you turn his opening strike into your Killing blow. Sweet. This thing looks like it could be a real lifesaver. Or life taker. I honestly have no idea. That's both. Alright. Hmm. Right, let's not spend forever looking for stuff. We'll head back to Torv and upgrade this and do the next mission. The problem is going to be remembering those general locations. Like, I think I remember the one with the three things hanging down. The two spires on that wall, maybe. Oh. What oh, are you doing? Found something, have you? Nice. Oh, so that's... Okay, that's... I love that. Well, time counters instantly kill enemy grunts. Ineffective against captains and beasts, but... Don't let All that right. fall into the wrong hands. How, how do we get over here? I just like that ability, because then if you get it right, just especially when you're surrounded by a group. Gorfin, mate. That was his brother. Yeah, 
But, uh, yeah. Alright. Oh, we could glide down there. I like because especially if you're surrounded by a group of orcs and they keep getting you, you can counter all you want, but you won't be able to finish any off because they keep attacking you. With this, though, that solves that problem. What is that? Oh, those are two grogs fighting. I don't know if we could survive a big drop, so... <laughs> Join Circa and his mercenaries as they raid an orc caravan. Yeah, they do kind of like. I was gonna say, I'm like, oh, do they? What do you see? Orcs, wagons, more orcs. <laughs> do you know what I see? Coin, fortune, and enough danger to make it fun. It seems you have better eyes than I do. It looks too, but who's keeping track? I suppose this coin you speak of is in those wagons, those surrounded by guards. They're soon to be dead guards. No survivors. The Overlord can't know that this is us. After all, he is paying us to keep these deliveries safe. <laughs> You're working for the Orcs. <sighs> Look, in this line of work, I can't choose where my coin comes from. Besides, if you're thinking about taking over that fortress, you're going to need my men. And if you need men, you need coin. <laughs> Help me, brother. I'll give you a family discount. How generous. Keep an eye out for wereworms. They're drawn to grog. Wereworms? Wereworms are dangerous creatures that live in the deserts of Lithlad. If anyone or anything walks in the vicinity of a wereworm mound, the sand will start to rumble. Shoot the mound to cause a wereworm to devour the closest creature. Interesting. Wereworms will also attack when grog is spilled onto the sand. To spill grog, slash at barrels with that. It's basically attack the barrels. <laughs> Do that afterwards. So, what are the wereworm mounds? I get oh no I have limited bolts. Trying to get the bonus objective. Well, there's a lot more to this caravan. Why we stop for a bunch of gloves in the rear? I like the It's different because before you had the arrow or the throwing hammer. I can't hit that from here. Another thing. Detonate. I'm pretty sure there is a thing on the ground. There it is. Alright, eliminate. 
Anyway, eliminate nearby enemies. Wait, is that the front or the end of the wagon? Alright, trying to be stealthy about this. Well, that didn't work. No, I no, I wanna let me down. These things look cool, but it's not letting me pick them up. You have to stay in them? Oh, those are steel bolts, okay. Can I free him? No? Can I free you, buddy? Wait, how do I collect a coin? Oh! I don't know what those red things are. Hold control to open the weapon wheel and select ammo type. Hold the aim, press that to fire. Oh. Concussion bombs. Oh, those are the health potions. Okay. Alright, so how am I supposed to get the coins? Just up here? Am I supposed to kill all of them? I guess I went too far down the line. Can I free these guys? I want to free them. I went all the way to the end of the line, that's why. We must have weak hands. That guy's talking to the old log that's tied up for some reason. This coin is from Minisithu. So I guess taking the gold frees the Wolwogs? I don't know. Oh. oh, you don't have to charge it either, that's nice. I like this. More loot from the city. I think we've established that. Oh, no, get out of the <laughs> I was trying to shoot the mound, but apparently his hitbox was just a bit larger than his actual body, so All I kept hitting it. Come through this canyon. I always like how free in the Ologs they help you. Which kind of makes sense, because it's like, Alright, you help me, and they're smarter. Supposed to be smarter this than Norse This is all general. Gondorian coin. And now, it's Easterling coin. Let's get these wagons back to the Oasis. Today, we get paid. These caravans have to stop. You and your boys need to get all this grog cleaned up before any werewolves show up. 
And don't spill any more, or you'll bring the rumbler here. The rumbler? Sounds like just what I need. It's time to spill some grog. Good thing we already took care of everybody over here. Whoops. Done. Cut off the enemy's supply line. That was also my supply line! I need to keep the coin flowing. Do you see those men back there? Those are not soldiers. Their loyalty is bought, and when they stop getting paid, their blades are no longer under my control. These are marauder orcs. When we take their fortress, you'll get half their fortune, and I'll use the other half to pay you and your men for whatever comes next. All right. You know, coin is one thing. That fortress is another. Oh, I hope you've got a great plan. <laughs> you know, they're mercenaries if they're decked out in gold. So that'll be it for this stream. Thanks for whopping, <laughs> watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you have a great rest of your day. GG, God bless, and see you later.